Hey guys, so here we are with a one more beautiful question, a very awesome question. So the question says that 5 raised to power 3x minus 5 raised to power 3x minus 2 is equals to 24 by 5. And we have to find the value of x. So let's see how we are going to do this. So first of all, uh, we know a property that if a raised to power m minus n, if this is the case, then we can write it as a raised to power m divided by a raised to power n. Because whenever we have a division, uh, the power gets subtracted. Okay. So we'll do the same thing here. 5 raised to power 3x minus 2 can be written as 5 raised to power 3x upon 5 raised to power 2. And this 5 raised to power 3x will remain as it is. Here we, we have a minus equals to 24 by 5. Now from this, we are able to see that 5 raised to power 3x and 5 raised to power 3x both has the same term. So we can take it common. So I'll, write, I'll take 5 raised to power 3x as common. In bracket, we are having 1 minus here we have taken the number so 1 is remaining and divided by 5 raised to power 2 that is 25 and that is equals to 24 by 5 now if you solve it further you can take the lcm you can send this 25 to the side so it will it will become 24 minus 1 25 minus 1 sorry divided by 25 and in bracket we here we have 5 raised to power 3x that is equals to 24 by 5 now very easily 25 minus 1 you are able to see that this is 24 here this is 25 equals to 24 by 5 and that is multiplied with 5 raised to power 3x so 24 and 24 gets cancelled 5 will cancel this 25 in 5 times and this 5 will go, go in the right hand side so we have 5 raised to power 3x is equals to 5 because this 5 goes to right hand side with a cross multiplication so 5 raised to power 3x is equals to 5 5 means 5 raised to power 1 so very easily we can able uh, we are able to find that 3x is equals to 1 uh, just we are uh, doing this uh, power matching so 3x is equals to 1 and hence we have got the value x is equals to 1 by 3 so very easily we have got this answer without doing much big uh, uh, calculations or doing some big mathematics it, it was a very simple question only you had to apply this standard 8th or standard 7th uh, formula that whenever you have same base and that's the same base having different powers they are divided the power gets subtracted so only this one simple formula you had to apply after that just simple solving class 5 class 6 solving and then you get the answer so i hope you all like this uh, solution if that is the case do let me know in the comment box